what is going on guys it is hydra hop and i have not done a commentary on the hydra clan channel for a while so in case you miss me drop a like no, i'm just kidding but anyways the gameplay we have here today is a i'm not gonna say i'm just gonna say it's crazy double free for all uh, moab with the aa12 and scar l kind of switching on and off it is on arcaden and the gameplay is from hydra destinized hope i got that right anyways if you guys enjoyed the gameplay, go check out his channel. If you enjoyed the commentary, be sure to go check out my channel. Both links will be in the description down below. And let's get into the commentary. So, what I want to talk to you guys about today is how pub stomping is going to be in Advanced Warfare, I believe it's called. So, yeah. Um, Advanced Warfare is obviously different. You guys probably know that. Uh, it's a lot of new features, like the mega jump thing, uh, when you can go side to side, do all those like crazy strays and stuff like that, like those crazy animations. So... I think that's really going to change up the pace, because normal Call of Duties like Black Ops, Modern Warfare, you know what I'm talking about, the standard old Call of Duties, it was easy. All you have to do, you get spawn traps, and you can just do anything, really. But I think Advanced Warfare spawn trapping is going to be very, very hard, and like pub stomping, getting really good gameplays, just because of how easily people will be able to avoid your bullets, you know, and stuff like that. Spawn trapping, I think, is going to be gone, because people, when they spawn, they're just going to jump up in the air. <laughs> I have a feeling and just kill you. So yeah, spawn trapping, I believe, is going to be gone, um... Also, um, pub stomping, I think it's going to be more of, like, players that actually know how to play Call of Duty the right way, not just, like, it's kind of hard to explain, but, like, in a sense, because there, there are some people that go pub stomping, but they just, like, use all the newbie attachments and stuff and camp in a corner, but I feel like you won't be able to do that anymore just because people are able to jump around the corner super quickly with all these new animations, and also the thing that lets you see through the walls, they'll be able to see, you, like, right through you, so really... I think you're going to be screwed a lot if you're camping in this game, and also just pub stomping because uh, it's going to be like harder because people are going to be jumping all over the place. You're, you're going to have people in the sky going up and crazy. Advanced Warfare is pretty much the chaotic version of Call of Duty, and I'm I'm happy for it because it seems like it's going to be a lot of fun to play. I can't wait to get it, actually. It's going to be a lot, a lot of fun to actually, um, you know, just try it out. A different pace to Call of Duty, I believe, because um, Call of Duty... It really needs a it needs a change badly. Black Ops 2 was still a great Call of Duty. It still was pretty fresh and new. But I feel like Ghost, they were really just trying to push out the last bit of that old Call of Duty style. And it really just did not work. I'll, I'll tell you guys that. So, yeah, really, that's what I think on pub stomping. Also, another thing I want to point out is that also with all the new weapons, there's like 300 different weapons if you count all those um, different like types of weapons. So, I have a feeling that pubs um the way gameplay is actually going to work out is because like you're really gonna have to choose your game style in advanced warfare i guess you could say because let's say you're one of those like um kind of laid back guys who you know they'll like watch the objective from up top or something so i think you're gonna probably use like one of the marksman ones that gives you a lower recoil but a lower fire rate so you know you can like be more accurate and stuff like that but then if you're a heavy running gunner you're probably gonna want to increase your fire rate and lower your accuracy i guess so you know, kind of trade-offs. I really think that in Advanced Warfare, you're going to have to, like, know how you want to play, especially with your custom classes with the new Pick 13. Damn, that's so original. But, yeah, uh, I think, really, that you're going to have to know what you want to do, be ready for, like, different things and stuff, because <laughs> I honestly think that if you're really good at Black Ops 2, you're really good at COD, COD 4, whatever you're good at, good. No one cares anymore. <laughs> it's Advanced Warfare. This game's going to change everything. I believe it's going to be a lot harder to get good gameplays. It's definitely going to... I think it's going to be a step up for the Call of Duty series, but I'm willing to bet, like, within the first, like, two weeks or something, probably someone's going to find something that's, like, overpowered or something, and then it's just going to ruin the game for a bit, and then they're going to patch it and stuff like that. So, yeah. Uh, Advanced Warfare, I think, also, it's going to... It's going in the right direction, because the old CODs, as I said before, is, like, it's really just boring and stuff like that. And also, the supply drops kind of copied it from battlefield in case you guys don't know what battlefield is it's kind of like these battle pack things they had it for a long time and that's warfare kind of stole it but like you get like weapons reticles same thing same thing as call of duty pretty much and yeah call of duty is also charging money on it so they're just kind of like taking battlefield's ideas but i think advanced warfare like they're going in the right direction like they're doing the right stuff but i feel like they're copying too much because um pick 13 that's biggest copy i've ever seen in my life um uh and also these supply drops and there's probably more that I just can't think of right now, but I think Advanced Warfare, it, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a great game, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be way better than Ghost, 
I can assure you guys of that, or else these YouTubers wouldn't be thinking so highly of it. And um, also, I think it's gonna be like really, really good, but I feel like there's gonna be like that one thing in the game that's gonna like totally like break the game, gonna make it not fun, and it's just gonna make you smash your controller and just like scream and like, yeah, cut for cod. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching the commentary. Hope you're able to enjoy. Uh, once again, the gameplay that you guys are seeing in the background is a Modern Warfare 3 gameplay, double free from Moab A12 slash Scar L on Arcaden. It is by D Destinized. Also, guys, if you want to check out my channel, my channel is Hopkite. It'll be also be linked in the channel. It'll also be linked in the description below. So yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace out. I wanna have